Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Good Omen Season 2, Episode 3. Let's get into this. Into the bookshop. Gabriel! Not him labeling everything as Jim. We all know it's fucking Gabriel. Oh my god, is it the angel police? Are they actually checking up on his miracle? Stop it. Stop it. I'm a human police officer. Hmm. Yes, a human police officer. Make sure to specify human. I thought you probably were. Hundred percent. Did you? Really? Oh, wonderful. <laughs> well, you're right. Right. <laughs> well. Yeah, I mean, she can monitor him. Like, no one's gonna question it. But why is her outfit all white? It's still weird. Inside, please. Only it's still really weird. Noisy out here. I can't hear anything. By all means. That's right. You can't wear white after Labor Day. You know, see, my friend makes a great point. You can't wear white after Labor Day. So, this is illegal. You are an officer breaking the law. You literally have to show her how to drink tea? Bro, these angels know nothing. They actually know nothing. Oh, no, you, you are dressed as a con No, no, you're not an inspector. You're literally dressed as a constable. Like, come on. Inspector know your constable. outfit. That's inspector constable? Stop. Stop. Yes, it's obviously her first visit to oh, Earth. Brother, no. Obviously. obviously. You can't say yes and then no. Bro, obviously, demon angel, like we know. 200 years? Oh. 200 years? Wow. But when I said and you're not going to drink tea? You're error, such a dumbass. Proves that I'm human. Such a dumbass. Cool. Perhaps we'll tell you everything we talked about afterwards. Oh. I'm supposed to observe you. Oh, okay, that's fine. We'll just tell you what we talked about after we're done talking, obviously. That works. That works. A hundred percent. Yeah, no one's gonna lie. Hundred percent. Always honest here. Go by train? No. Don't want your plan. Don't want to go by train. Give me the fucking car keys. Car keys, please. Yes! <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> well. Totally knew that I had to wait a few days. 100%. Remember I've been on this earth for 200 years? Please don't crash this car. Please. That's all I gotta say. That's a great car. Okay, so this is the statue of Gabriel? No, it's not. That's not what Gabriel looks like. This is a lie. We've seen Gabriel over... All of season one and no. When did Gabriel ever look like this? That hair's a lie? Those wings might be the truth. But even when he was in fucking heaven, he wore a suit. Bullshit. Bullshit. Falser. It's definitely Gabriel. It's uncanny. Do you think Imagine if you were an angel and you went to Earth just to fucking go stare at your own statue? That's fucking pathetic. Come on. No, no he doesn't. I, I don't believe that. Yeah. I should warn you. What's happening here? Up bodies. Uh, is it illegal? Well, it's wrong. Wow, great, great excuse. Doing this is wrong. You shouldn't do that. Oh well, I'll just stop then. I'll stop. I'll put the body back. It's fine. Family to cry fine. over. No, would you like to be hand with your cops? Don't you know that it's wrong? All I know is there's a. What is wrong? Why is she body snatching? What is happening? Okay, gotcha. So that she's selling dead bodies that have just died, like cadavers, to a doctor, bro. What? You don't have to do this. You could be a bookseller. I can't read very well. Why is he want everyone to be a bookseller? Dude, you own a bookshop. Do you want competition everywhere? I don't own a shop. Well. This piss drenched patch is where me and my pal sleep. It'll make me more. This piss drenched patch is where me and my fam sleep. What the actual fuck? Help this woman right now. Help this poor woman. Never better, Hen. Never better. Just try. You didn't. Please tell me you didn't. Oh, she absolutely did. 
Oh, she most certainly did, and he's loving it. Nice, fresh body. It was just this once. I Tell him. Quite right. Quite right. How mean. Dude, come on. No help? It was wonderful to meet you. Be more just like, yeah, she's going to hell. Yep, you're right. You're a dick, Aziraphil. You're, you're the angel here. What the fuck? This is wicked. Oh, I'm done with wicked. Anyway, is it wicked she needed the money? That is irrelevant. Look, I... It is not irrelevant. It's not that wicked. Someone died, and they buried the body, had the funeral, and it was a fresh, fresh gravesite. She stole the body. Yes, it's messed up. But she stole it to sell the body for money to feed her mom and get a proper, like, boarding place for them. That's, like... The whole debate about religion. No, this is not wrong. She is a fucking saint for her mom. I'm good. You? I'm afraid. No. That's ineffable. That's actual lunacy. You have more opportunities when you're poor? No. What? That's actual lunacy. No, please don't. Bro. The show. Did you know you have more opportunity? I'm literally pausing the recording for this because I need. Are you getting it? Even it. What do you mean you can feel when I drive the Bentley under the speed limit? And why are you going 30? What's wrong with you, dude? I'm sure you can't. I can. Good job. Change it back. 100%. Tell me the moment we learn anything. No, of course. Yeah, we're obviously going to tell you the moment that we learn something, Beelzebub, but why do you think that we wouldn't? Where would this new information come from? Y'all have done nothing. Y'all are just waiting. Asking why about gravity? Um, because the planet's big? I don't know. Honestly, uh... Um, baboom. So he's literally gonna try the rain technique. Bro, I don't think that's gonna work. Baboom. That's a plan. Don't think so. No. I'm done weathering it. Why are you thwarting her plan? Doctor... She's literally selling a dead body. Stop thwarting her plan. Dalrymple? What? Mr. Dalrymple. F-R-C-S-E. I'm a surgeon of a doctor. Quite unsanitary using the same napkin and just keep cleaning well, up. Come on. Washing your hands. Yeah, it's wash your hands. In a few years, I'm telling you. You're a funny one. Something smells rather. Dude, you literally miracled the body to melt? Man, right. that's just messed up. That is messed up. Is this a joke? I'm awfully sorry, Mr. Dalrymple. The trouble is, there are never enough murders. Hmm. I'm sorry. There are never enough murders? When is that a problem? Murderers get hanged. No one cares if we cut up murderers. Excellent idea. Fair. No okay. Murders, I'll Fair. To that. But if you're in such dire need of bodies, lives. He's got a point. I mean, yeah, he is the doctor. Like, that's grunt work finding the bodies. Yeah, doctors don't do that. Wow. What is that your is professional fair. opinion on that, doctor? A lot more. And how on earth are we going to win the battle against Muslims? Oh yeah, he's sad because that giant tumor came out of a seven-year-old boy. Yeah, I get it. That's super sad. Bro, you think that he wanted the bodies for bad reasons? Like, what's wrong with you, dude? Atrocities like this one. I'm just trying to save lives. <laughs> I mean, at least he made it there. Good job. He made it there and didn't crash. I can help this time. I don't trust you. I don't know what you th Yeah, it's a good thing now, so I can help this time. Well, Aziraphil, you should have just stayed out of it in the first place. I did, but you made that happen. I tell that to the poor souls who only get into heaven because their bodies... Go right down their heads. Yeah, you're okay with the rich just being able to protect their dead bodies and the poor not, yeah? Oh, yeah, you I seem like you are. Nice pressure. It nice seems like he is. Ah! 
Holy hell. Obviously the fire no. alerted the local watchman. No. Thank you for helping, Crowley. Sorry, I thought it was her mom, but it's like her friend. Yeah, sorry. Still, like, that's amazing. That's really sad. And she was being, a, she was just trying to be helpful. That's fair. Get the cart. That's a fresh body. She's a crushed body. You'd be wrong, but I think Elspeth's taking wee more act, Mr. D if anyone out there will give you more for her, but I'll give you five. Wow. Just not even seven pounds? Come on, dude. Yep, poison. Please. Nope. No, you're not, dude. Crowley took it. No, 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 no. What did you say? Yep. Do? Nah, he'll be fine. Constitution of an ox. Why well, do not need laudanum to kill oh, myself? Oh, no dying. Enough dying. No Crowley, I... Crowley gone. Where are you? He gone. Don't you dare step on me. I see ha. you. <laughs> he got shrunk. <laughs> there you go. Good job. Too tall. Too tall, Crowley. Too tall. Come on. That. Uh, virtues of poverty. Oh, oh, no, like there's no virtues of poverty, dude. Give her the money. By a grave gun or hanged if she doesn't top herself first. Lord Honestly, that was a good plan. That was a pretty good plan. Last time I do that. Where are you? I'm, I'm, I'm Will you get into trouble? Well, they'll surely have noticed downstairs. You nah, they won't have noticed downstairs. They don't care. Indeed, indeed. Trust me, if hell noticed that little display, I'd already be. I'd already be. Yep, you'd be taken back down. They did notice. That okay. Was the last I was to see of Crowley for quite some time. Privacy. What if we say no? I'm out of minutes, but here you go. <laughs> <clears throat> you um, don't say no to the angel. Hello. Um, I'd like you to call the telephone in my bookshop, please. Phone? No, not how it works. Holy hell. What? Good job. Good job. You haven't actually been selling any of the books, have you? No, I haven't been selling the books. Your books are fine. Not a one. Oh, good. <laughs> Clue? Okay. Okay, Rain. I can do Rain. Can you do Rain? I'm not sure what happened the other night, but can we talk? Come on, talk to her. You don't like the person that you're with. We don't have anything to talk about. There you go. Let it happen naturally. You're upset and you're acting as if it's my fault. Going out. Come on, I'm in. Such a hard brain. <laughs> Bro, calm down with your demon powers. It was already happening. You ruined the moment, dude. You ruined that moment. Yeah, not gonna happen. So, nope. Excuse me? Nope, can't come in. Listen. There he is! You saw him! When there's no hot water, and two Gotta lights, love oh, yeah. that. What is that? Like, oh, yeah, miracle. Yeah, uh, that happened. There's a little. Uh, uh, 
Honestly, that's just funny that she can't go in. He can't even let her in. I don't know why she's so mad. No, or yes, or yes. Oh, he doesn't want his friend to get hurt. It doesn't matter. It's too late for that now. Well, if you made it this far, thanks so much for watching. Please hit that like button. Maybe leave a comment down below. All right, love y'all. Y'all slay and I slay. So let's slay together. Bye.